Hello viewers, uh, my name is Andrew and this is my first video for Psych2Go. This video is going to be about emojis. This video is based on a Psych2Go article by Psych2Go contributor Lupna. And most of what she had to say is that in visual communication with other people, we rely on facial cues for a lot of the communication. Uh, it's generally accepted that a lot of communication isn't solely based on our words, but most of it is based on our body language. Uh, we read other people's body language and their facial expressions to get their message, not by just their words. But when we're using text messages, we don't have the other person's face to get the complete emotional message. So emojis can help us with that. But of course, sometimes people use emojis just to be funny as well. I've also heard from some people that some men choose not to use emojis in their text messages because they seem feminine and they don't want to seem feminine themselves. I haven't heard this directly from someone, but then again, I use them, so maybe I don't hang out with those kinds of people. Another interesting extension of this is the way that people don't use punctuation or do use punctuation when they're typing their text messages. Most of the time, people, at least uh, in my generation, around um, maybe between 15 and 25 who text, uh, they don't, might probably choose not to put a period at the end of their text message. Um, if you do get a text message that has a period at the end of, of the last sentence, it can come off as being kind of serious or stern in mood or tone. Uh, a lot of people just choose to end their sentence with LOL or haha to just make sure they know that everything is good and it's still lighthearted. Um, if you get a text from a parent uh, or someone who's older, they'll probably choose to put a period at the end of their text because it's more similar to email that they're accustomed to or any other kind of written message where they put punctuation at the end of everything. May even sign it off with their name. So what do you think about the use of emojis and punctuation? Do you end every sentence with a period? Or do you put haha or lol? And why do you think you do that? If you send a text with a period, what does it really mean? Do you put that at the end on purpose? Also, when you send emojis, why do you send them? Do you send them to people you're familiar with or to everyone? Do you wait until they use one to send one or do you just send them away? Uh, let me know in the comments below. And I hope to see you next time. Bye.